Sports. Rich Donnelly takes us to the Navy ship. Our journey to the Orlick actually began on a tugboat on the St. Johns River east of downtown Jacksonville. Dolphins followed that boat on our way to the Orlick. After a quick ride, there it was, the gray ghost of the Vietnam coast. Members of the Jacksonville Naval Museum worked for 12 years to bring a ship to Jacksonville, and we get one of the most decorated ships of the Vietnam War era. Dozens of other boats followed alongside on our way towards downtown. Passing under the Matthews Bridge was a cool experience, and we knew we were that much closer to taking the Orlick home. A JFRD fireboat blasted water cannons into the air to start the welcome party. Countless people waved along the shore as the destroyer passed by. And then there it is, downtown Jacksonville, the new home of the USS Orlick. But that was far from the only homecoming today. Men who served on the ship and family members of those who served were invited to walk aboard and say hello. Nocatee resident Guy Dietz served on the Orlick when he was 23 years old in 1966. Just wow. It's gorgeous. Got goosebumps. It's a blast just being back aboard. But watching it come in and the people that came down, it's, it's beautiful. Beautiful day for it. Beautiful turnout. It was gorgeous. For other veterans, today was a reunion nearly 50 years in the making. It just brings back a lot of memories, man. Makes you feel young again. You remember it. Daniel Bean with the Jacksonville Naval Museum worked for 12 years to bring a ship to Jacksonville. And the day finally came when his hard work sat on the north shore of the St. John's River. I'm very proud of the effort that we all put in to get it here. She looks better than any Navy warship on active duty right now. We're very proud of, of what we were able to do here. The USS Orlick will undergo repairs for about a month before it's ready for full-time visitors. But now it's home. Reporting in Jacksonville, Rich Donald, First Coast News, on your side. Thank you so much, Rich.